What's about to come there when the karate chop your face? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a of a two part series introducing Linob Heads. Last night on the twenty fifth of April of two thousand and twelve, the boys from the D three VD, we went on to Team Deathmatch. We had a few little games. And we really, really like it when we can put our skills against a full clan. A full clan came in called N40. Okay. Now, N40 and what their clan title was, it said Naughty Forties. So, hey, these guys have got to be a little bit of a good laugh, haven't they? You'd think so. It'd be a good laugh. Yes. So we thought that. We thought that indeed. Ooh, look at this. Just a sort of world reveal on May the 1st. Where you gonna be, sucker? Where you gonna be? I'll probably be on the toilet, watching YouTube while steaming a shit. In fact, speaking of shit, this back to this clan, which were N40. <laughs> You'll see here, this is the last game that we played last night online. It was Arkden. Is it Arkden? Arkden, from it's your German here. I can't do a German accent, never mind. We won this game. Um, the last five games that we played stand here in Bakura. Running to Resistance, running through to Lockdown, Dome, and finally Acton were all played against this team. Okay. Now, I just want to go into the team um, in, in a moment and tell you a little bit about them. But what happened is we played this first game and we won this 7-5 to 6 -7. You can see that. It was very, very cool. So let's have a look at the scoreboard. There was me. There was Pixel Hated, there was Sweet Audio, and down at the bottom there, second bottom, was Sud 1976, putting in a good shift. Okay. Good game. It's a good game, you know? I like little close games, especially when, like I said before, it's a full team you pin yourself against. So, this happened, and then the minute and a half between games that occurred after that was just crazy. Really, really crazy. Um, we got nothing but abuse... Um, just the piss taken out of us and, and and falsely accusing people of playing a game the way that they don't actually play it we got classed as campers <clears throat> now it's not very good to be classed as a camper because me personally and I've said this on many many videos it's so boring to play as a camper so goddamn boring I nearly hit a Moab the other day and I had to camp because I was for, I, I tell you it was squeaky bum time it was squeaky bum time, so I thought, you know, when I got to like 18 kills, I was camping, and I, I even got bored of my own gameplay. Now, I'm hoping to put that up at the, towards the end of the week, whatever. So anyway, let's just get back into these now. All I can say in this minute and a half that happened is we discussed with them the fact that we weren't camping, it's just the fact that we were better players. But that is obviously not an option. Not an option at all, it seems. And uh, to be honest with you, it was uh, the way that they were speaking to us made me want to say that uh, you you are uh, you to do a uh, modern modern warfare. So you are just just a big big disgrace. Yes, and I just wanted to do a karate chop to the side of their face. Yes. Anyway, all I want to say is these guys with their abuse um, that they kind of backfired on them a little bit um, because they asked us where we were, who we what we were doing. Um, the fact that they were taking the piss because we were playing a game on a computer. Um, but what I don't understand is they were doing exactly the same, so they're taking the piss out of everybody. But anyway, what occurred from this was us getting abused every single time we went into a lobby for the next four games because the rage quit at the end and we thought, you know, <laughs> we'll call it a night. Um, but various things that were said um, included one of their guy's mums um, a 24 inch dildo um, apologies for anybody who knows me is really saying this but I can just only appreciate what they are saying and a bucket but the thing is rather than say that like someone else's mum is this he actually said that his mum gobbles them up like they were a twizzly piece of you know the shoestring lace stuff that you can eat they're like licorice type stuff so I I, I, I I don't know if he's too stupid to actually insult us. Right, but anyway, let's get into these. First one is Flicky21. This guy um, seemed to be in the same place as he was. Nemesis a man quite a bit. 
he was in the same place quite a few times, but obviously that's not camping. That's not camping to him. Let's have a look at his player card. Let's have a look see what he's doing. I don't want to track him because I don't track shit. <laughs> shit. That's what you are. You are shit. Right. Okay. <laughs> KD ratio 0.39. Oh, shit. Um, win percentage 14. Oh, God. The less said about that, the better. How he can say anything to anybody is, is beyond me. Oh, God, I, I, think, I think I need a drink. I think I need a drink, something strong. Because looking at stats like that makes me want to cry. It makes me want to cry. So, next one that we have. Oh, stupid loading screens. So that, that, that was flicky. Right, come on. There we go. We're going to go back. And let's have a look at this guy who was Emmer Keter Bridge Durker Durker Haka Ducky Ducky Duck Duck. No. <laughs> there we go. Now, all these people I'm showing you are all on PS3. Okay? Naughty 40 OES goal for the third time in a row. Ah, awkward. So, all of these people are on PSN. Add them. Um, tell them that they suck balls and they're stupid. 34% win rate and 1.27 on your KD ratio. Congratulations, you still suck. Yeah. He's got to be proud of himself, hasn't he? I mean, look, at 34%, he's only played 21 hours. And there's his, like, obviously the losses that have come in the account. Oof. Crazy, crazy, crazy stuff. Anyway, just a little while I'm going through these, just to mention a little bit about me. I've hit the Prestige 9. I have two Prestige tokens and... On Saturday, I mean Saturday, um, we're looking as the clue, the crew, sorry, to go into another clan battle. We get silver in that. We go up to the level ten for the D3VD, which is two hours of nice doubles XP for us. Here's the next one, Dangle, nineteen eighty-two. Okay, good KD ratio on this guy. This is one point five six. That's better than me. Three hundred and twenty hours played. Congratulations, you suck. And uh, win percentage of 47%, so almost 1 in 2 that he wins. Okay, Dangle, 1982. Very, very imaginative name there. Okay. Ooh, hashtag awkward. That's all I'm saying. So the next one that we carry on and we go on, that's the three of them we've looked at now. So we've looked at that, that and that one. Next one is uh, Golfman, the Golfman TDI. Now, clearly, if he's a Golfman TDI, I wonder what type of car he has. And also the fact that if he is a man or a woman. That'd be funny, but the way he was speaking to us last night, he had no balls. He was going to caps lock us to fucking death. Yep, that's how awkward it was. Well, it seems to me this guy doesn't actually have any stats, which is a bit awkward. Yeah. Um, but I can only assume he sucks anyway. Hmm, question mark, what is all this? Hmm, right, I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll go back, we'll see if we can uh, go back onto him. If not, then we'll just assume that his team, that his total is that rubbish that he, uh, he doesn't want anyone to see it. And that would be a little bit hashtag awkward. Anyways, K there first year in that game was 0.46. Can't remember when I had 0.46. Oh, wonderful, 0.46. Oh, here we go. Oh, so look at this guy. This guy's prestige 13. But he sucks ass. He's 0.62. 46% win streak. I said before, he was probably a bit scared of showing his stats. Ah, awkward. I think it's actually right. Right. Okay, what have I got here? Went a bit too far there. Went a little bit too far. Right, and then it leaves us with the last one, which is um, a personal friend of mine. Um, now, I don't actually know this guy, but uh, the reason why I'm saying this guy is because... On the last game, he's the one who rage quit. We made this guy rage quit. <laughs> so, yes, there was about three kills left to go, and he raged. So, 
I think congratulations on your little recent winnings there, my friend. I have to say, congratulations, you've done well. But when it comes to Modern Warfare 3, um, yeah, um, oh, come on, you're on time. I've got, I've got a bloody bacon on. If you're already up, stupid loading. Switchman, there we go. So it's Prestige 8. 1.08, 40%. So only one of them guys has stats ready to shout about. I know they say that you know you're an average player if you get eight. No, sorry, an even kill streak of one, a kill death even. But um, yeah, I wouldn't want to be him. It's like you say, all of those people are on PS3. Add them, um, tell them they're an idiot, and uh, tell them Skull said so. Um, we're gonna. I'm gonna message him again and invite him to some more games with us because it would be really, really good if we could. Um, I, I really, really want to win some more matches and get my winning streak above 28. So if we could do that, that would be about brilliant. So a little bit there. Look, prestige nine, level 20. KD ratio 1.32, and the win percentage of 61%. Uh, like, <sighs> I love it when you just. Let me destroy people. I just want to give us all that malarkey. So anyway, um, this is me about out now. I'm just this is a little bit of a introduction to these idiots. But this match here, resistance. I have that footage on the uh, laptop. And um, what I'll be doing is I'll be putting that online shortly with a commentary on, of course, to discuss more tactics and discuss little bits in there. Um. So. Yeah, comment on this. Go add those guys as friends. Get yourself in the t into the naughty forties, because guaranteed, if you do, you'll be the best player that's in there. Yep, without a shadow of a doubt. So if you could do that, that'd be brilliant. If you could add them as a friend, um, just basically tell them uh, that they camp. Just, just that. Don't, don't swear at them. Don't give them abuse. They're the ones who give the abuse. Um, just say, all right, campers, what's going on? Just tell them it's not cool because <laughs> it isn't so that's me out now and uh, any questions you know the stuff you know the stuff comment rate subscribe I'm gone peace out yeah I rock